Hello, brothers and sisters, and welcome back to Dinkum, the Australian version of games like Animal Crossing, My Time at Porsche, and Stardew that you're going to want to try out next. So, where we left off last time is I let myself pass out for the night to see what happens. It's kind of funny because it makes it look like you die because you kind of do. And then you re hit revive and then you spawn in your house. And I got a milestone out of it, so whatever. But I'm out here now. You can see I took a request from Fletch. Uh, we need to build a forge. So to do that, I need to make a campfire, get stone, which I actually don't have enough of. This pick might break before I get stone. Didn't even... Oh, I got one. Oh, and I'm almost out of stamina too, but I've got cooked fruits that we can eat. Too full. Okay, it looks like I can only eat a few snacks at a time. All right, we're going to find out what happens when I break a tool, I think, here in a moment. And I'm going to just... Put... Okay. And it broke. Okay. Yeah, so your tool just gets absolutely shredded. Cool. Good chat. Uh, what are these things made of? Here's a milestone for breaking tools. Awesome. I'm, I'm so glad we're hitting all these different milestones for being a piece of shit. Okay. So I'm going to head back to the trader. Where is he? Where am I? There he is. It's right there. I'm going to head over to him. I was going to see if there's any bugs on the way, but I don't see any. How about a fish? Can we learn how to fish? I don't see a fish in here. Why is the... F oh. Oh. My tools are degraded. So when you pass out, your tools degrade. Okay. Good to know. Not going to do that again. Did it for science, so you don't have to. So it looks like he gets the same stuff back, at least in for the time being. So I'm going to buy a new pickaxe. Yep. Also gonna buy a new axe because I know I'm gonna break that soon. Thanks. And then I'm gonna talk to you. And I'm gonna sell you. Um I actually don't really have anything to sell. How about five of these? 950. That's actually cheaper than the other thing, but those do more for me. So let's sell. I'm going to sell these berries. We can find these pretty easily. 2,000. Yep. Take those. Take my fruit. Get a couple more milestones here. So here's a milestone for selling fruit. Uh, equipped by five tools and savvy shopper. Uh, here's just, oh, so for spending our money in general. All right. Nothing to do about being savvy. It's just about selling. Okay. Or buying in that instance, I should say. We got our crocodilies over here, so I'm gonna head back. I've got everything I need so we can talk to Fletch and continue on with these main quests. There's a fish in there, but he's not happy about me looking at his fish, so I'm gonna go home. Nice chat with your crocodilly. We got some ores over there I can grab next time. Alright, Fletch, what's up, girl? Oh boy, I don't know if... I don't know. What's up, Fletch? I know I could count on you to find everything we need. Here's a recipe for a crude furnace. Well, now why don't you try to craft it? All right, and then just place the ore inside of it. It'll take a little while to do its thing, so feel free to do other activities while it's melted. Bring me the tin bar when you're ready. Very well. Crude furnace. Might be one of those things where we need to make a few of them if they're going to take a lot of time. All right, so we need a campfire, stones, and tin. Five tin specifically. Okay. It's kind of a weird recipe, but it's not bad. All right, place the crude furnace down outside. Okay, outside. I'm going to put it near my house. Like next to it right here. Beautiful. And we need to put the tin inside. Okay. Insert. Okay, we'll see how long that takes. And what I can do is we can cook some limes real quick. There is an achievement for cooking limes, which is silly. So I'm going to just put that in there. I'm going to talk to you. Uh, I want to apply for a, a license. So what could I do? Excavation, purchase, and use shovels. Allows you to unlock the farming skill. Um, tool belts. Hold it to craft new pathing options. Bridges. All right, we'll, we'll work down. So let's get the shovel. 
at least buy one from our boy over there. Metal detecting allows the holder to buy a metal detector to search for treasure, I'm assuming that's what it says. Um, I'm going to do trapping license, because that sounds pretty useful, honestly. Animal collection, okay. Simple animal trap, noted. And buy and raise jukes. That sounds amazing. So we can build a bird coop eventually. All right, a thousand, Ooh, raise Vombat? Yes, give me Vombat, give me Vombats now. I want them, okay. So that's good, that's fine. Let's throw another one of you in here. Let me grab this. Still haven't figured out how to like plant this thing yet. That's why I'm assuming I need the shovel. What's that daily say? Catch three fish? Hell yeah, we'll catch three fish. It's on my, it's on my to-do list today. You've proven yourself invaluable yet again. You're starting to really carry a lot of stuff. I'll tell you what, I'll teach you how to craft a wooden crate. You're going to need a recipe for nails, too. I'll tell you what, Shiblin is on its way to being a great settlement again. With a furnace and a table, we can start thinking about building more permanent structures. Tell you what, we should try and get John to set up a real shop. Let's do it. That's the spirit. I reckon if we spend a bit of money in his tent, he'll see it as an opportunity. Oh, and we should show him how friendly people are around here. Why don't you ask John if he has anything he needs done? If we can prove to him that Shibland is a great place to move, I'm sure he'll live here for good. So the last time I asked him if he had a job for me, he just tried to sell me something. Obviously didn't know what it was, so I said no, and then he got sad. So, you know, there's that. But that's okay, too. So we're going to grab that. Give me my cooked lime. Wait for that. Oh, perfect. Oh, it requires five. Okay, so we're a little short. It's a good thing that I saw this tinny over here. Bam. All right, I'm going to farm this up. I'll eat some limes if necessary. What is that I just picked up? What's this? Grass seed? Oh! Okay. Well, just planted some grass there, I guess. Very well. I guess some seeds will just plant automatically. The gum seed, maybe I need, a, maybe I need something special for to grow trees. Or maybe I just couldn't do it on clay? Nope, can't do it here either. No. No. All right, back to the drawing table. Found some fish over here while I was out looking for bugs and whatnot. So let's see. Woo! Oh, Jesus. Okay. Okay. Tip, tip, tip. Cheerio. Bam. Okay. Okay. Okay, let them struggle. Oop. Okay. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. It's cool. It's cool. Is that a little too far away from that guy? Yeah, he's not going to see it. Again, it's hard to tell where we're aiming here. Did he disappear? Hello? Okay. Come on. Okay, come on in. Reel it, reel it. All right, he's tired. Oh, it broke. Shit. Okay. Fishing's a little hard, but once we get used to it, I'm sure we'll be good to go. What if I tease you guys a lot closer to me, like this? Oh, too far. Too close. Tease it. All right, perfect. Come on, come on. So it doesn't look like my tension comes back to me. Maybe slowly. Oh, no, I swapped my tool by mistake. Um, uh, I broke the game. Literally broke it. I can't, uh, <laughs> I can't do anything. I can only switch the cameras. All right, so it looks like you break the game if you're fishing and you accidentally press, like, the right bumper or you press the swap tool button. How stupid. How can you have this in a... Even though it's an early access, like... That's such a common thing. All right, I guess I got to restart. Let's see where it leaves me.
All right, so obviously the game saves uh, when you wake up. So I got to restart the day. It's not the end of the world, but it's really stupid that it happened on a bug that I don't think should ever exist in a game because it's such... Like, if I press a swap button while doing something, that's, it's so basic. Like, it shouldn't even be a thing for people to be, like, overlooked completely and for it to freeze and crash your entire game. Oh, well. I'm going to go back. I'm going to grab... Um, um, boom, 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 boom. Nope. Okay. Just go that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back out and gather. I'm going to grab stuff for the campfire. I'm going to grab um, the rocks. We need to make a forge. So we'll get all of that taken care of. And then we'll catch right back up to where we left off. While running around, I found a big ass fish out here. I don't know if I'll catch it, but I'm going to tease him in a bit. Come here. My little beluga whale. Come on. Okay. Come on, tickle it. Tease it. Okay, let him go, let him go, let him go. Oh, shit, he broke the crap out of that. Might be too strong for this one. I'll try one more time. I think I thought I saw one more that was a little closer to the shore over here, but maybe not. Maybe he moved. Let's crank it. Woo! I don't think teasing the shoreline's really doing me any good. Come on. Oh, he's a tired boy. Oh, come on. Don't tease me like that. My heart can't handle it. All right, what'd I get? What'd I get? Woo! He's massive. We got an eel-tailed catfish. That's actually a pretty cool fish. Okay. Very well. Ten points for creativity already. Let's get another one. Also looks like an e eel-tailed catfish to me. Looks like patience is our best friend with fishing, which makes sense. It's fishing, I suppose. And he is cruising. Relax, my boy. Looks like you can tease the reel in button a little bit to jerk it. I don't think it's doing anything though, but you can and it doesn't cause tension. Like I'm teasing it right there. I don't know if it did much, but in my head it does. All right, got another one. I wonder what those will sell for. I also saw a butterfly over here, so we're going to grab that and then we're going to go ahead to our boy. Do you think this jellyfish hurts me? Oh! Yeah, it made me jump. That made me jump in real life. All right. Uh, poisoned? Oh, God. Being poisoned might not kill you, but it'll take a lot of energy out of you. Okay. These jellyfish are poisonous. Now, before you're like, oh, of course they are, Shabby. Not all jellyfish are poisonous. Let's all freaking relax, okay? What is that? Oh, that's just my footprints. Where'd that butterfly go I saw? Maybe it moved up. I'm not sure unfortunate I'm gonna grab the fruit fruits easy easy money we got a roux baby we got some turkeys we got shells I'm gonna grab the shells just because we do have um, objectives for collecting trash and shells are apparently trash and they're free energy and also it does the environment well here apparently um, I thought I just saw a fish yep let's grab this fish see what you do Hi! Let's see if you're any easier to catch than that other one. Ooh. Okay, he, he got me. Wasn't expecting the first bite to just suck it all in. Wait, what the? Is that what you guys do? Nope. Gotcha. Man, that's a quick one. Look at these suckers go. Oop, he tricked me. It feels faster if I just tap it. Definitely feels faster. So what is this? I just got I just got some permit points too. I caught a blue spot flathead. Cool. Look at that turkey swim. What did I get? Why'd I get permit points? 
I don't know. You think a jellyfish will hook on? I mean, it's moving towards it? Coincidence? This would be silly. Don't do it. It's coincidence, okay. Uh, I, I was about to be a little annoyed if I... Oh god, don't see me? Do you think it'll happen? Hold on, let's, <laughs> let's do this. A little harder? All right, would have been funny. Would have been funny. A little trash can here, but I don't have a pickaxe. I broke my pickaxe on my way here, so it's all right. I need to buy a new pickaxe. I'll probably buy, well, I'll probably buy a new ax as well. And we'll sell some goodies to our boy here. Hello. So the first thing I'm gonna do is sell to you, and then I'm gonna ask you if you got a job for me. So I'm gonna go through, we're gonna sell all of our shells because he loves shells. And then I'm gonna sell... Rupu was worth nothing. Um, I'm not gonna sell him. I'm gonna sell him nothing else for the moment. I'm gonna sell these. Batch was worth 243. It's literally worth like garbage, but that's fine. I wanna see what these fish are worth. So the eel-tailed catfish, 1400. Okay. And what about the eel-tailed catfish? Oh no, that's what I just did. How about the blue spot flathead? 998. Okay, cool. Not bad stuff, not bad stuff. Uh, I wonder what this geode sells for. It says this is a shiny rock, there might be something in it. But I don't know how to open it. No thanks. I'll hold that. Let's see what I can get out of it. All right, sell to you. And let's just sell my last fish. And I think that's the only thing I have left that I will sell to you. Yes. Perfect. Thank you. All right, now let's ask if he's got a job for us. What the hell? I didn't select anything. Need anything? Would be too much trouble for you to catch a to catch mangrove jack. Can usually catch them in the mangro mangroves this time of year. Sure. Must be completed by the end of the day. Duly noted. So I'm gonna buy a new axe. Can I just get like a quick buy option? I don't need you to tell me what a what a pickaxe does or an axe does. You know what I mean? I'm also gonna buy a new fishing pole. I'm sure I'm going to break it, and I'm going to buy a shovel. Oh, I didn't get my... Damn it. I had I got my licenses last time, but with the reset, I forgot to get them again, I guess. So whatever. That's fine. I'm going to catch butterflies. Let's go see if we can catch a mangrove jack and catch butterflies and see if we can uh, be friends with our little boy over here. You know, do a, do him a favor, scratch his back, he'll scratch my back. I don't know. We'll find out. And I also got to go figure out what the mangroves are. Caught a fly. Got a blue moon butterfly. These look like mangroves. So we know what the, the eel-tailed catfish looks like, right? Uh, let's see. Buy tools. Yep, I already got both of these the last time. So I'm just going to take a peek ski in the water here. I'm not seeing any fish. I see a jellyfish, and I'm not going to be tricked by them again. Nothing across the bay. That's a new fish. Hello, friend. Are you a mangrove jack? Come on, just suck it down. Put it in your mouth. Thank you. All right, so this is tapping. It's pretty fast, right? Okay. And then holding. That feels slower. I don't know if it's like the angle of the fish, but it definitely feels slower to hold it. All right, that's a river bass. So maybe this is a river, not a mangrove. I don't know, I thought this was a mangrove. Maybe I don't know what a mangrove is. Grove is. I don't think I do. Is that the is that the eel thingy out there? Hey, 
Give me that. Um, where is it? I lost it. It's out there somewhere. That is the eel fish. It looks like there's two of them out there. These definitely look like mangroves to me. Are you guys messing with me? What if I look at the map? Are you labeled? Oh. So maybe if I go over... No, I'm... Maybe these are mangroves? I don't know. Is that new? No, that looks like the same fish I just caught. That is... That's different. What are you? Come on, bite it. Put it in your mouth. Yeah. Well, that took a lot of durability. Tap, 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 tap. Pro strats here. We're three ticking. Got him. That's a mangrove jack. Look at him. He's cute. Oh, he's adorable. I'm going to grab this fish too. Then I'm going to go back. I'm going to go talk to Fletch. We're going to craft our first furnace. Oh, I scared him off. Hold, hold too hard. Never yank too hard, guys. All right, he's just ignoring me because he's a jerk. One more time and I'm just going to move on with my day. All right, see you later, bud. All right, I'm going to go make the furnace again, and I'm going to actually grab some extra rocks because I want to make two since we know how they work now. So I'll go do that real quick. No need to bug you guys in seeing something twice. I kept you along, obviously, because we had some good fishing to be had here. But guys, if you're loving Dinkum, like I keep saying, make sure you're hitting that like button down below and subscribing as well so you do get back here for that sweet, shabby content. You don't want to miss what we got going on. We've got Dinkum. We've also got some auto knots. We got auto knots versus pirate bots. We've got a lot happen on the channel, so keep in touch. I made my two furnaces and I talked to Fletch so we could get some stuff done. I'm just running back here because our inventory. Oh my God, John's running. He's leaving. He's leaving. Hold on, John. Will you let me sell you if you're out here? Good day. How can I help you? Yeah, let's. Uh... Oh shit, I can't. This is for you. You've got the mangrove jack? Yeah. Here it is. Give it. You're, wow, you really found... Why am I holding a pickaxe to his head? You're the best! I really owe you one. Here, take this. It's not much, but I hope you like it. Thanks again. What do you give me? Red shorts. Cool. So if I go inside, I can buy... Oh, no, the shop is closed. Okay, so I gotta wait till tomorrow to sell him some stuff. It's already the bloody Arvo. Let's chat. The secret to trading is buy low, sell high. I probably should have sold you that information. Probably. You've decided you really like it here, so I spoke to Fletch and I've applied for a deed so I can set up a permanent shop here in town. Awesome. Hope I can move in soon. A new deed is available. Talk to Fletch to apply for deeds, okay? Uh, let's hang out. Thanks for asking. But uh, you should get to know each other a little bit first. All right, I guess he doesn't want to be wooed. Helpful friend. Okay, we got that. The, huh? the way my character moved, I thought like, I started to fly for a second. It was weird. All right, I'm just going to head home. Um, I'll probably just grab some stones around the house and some wood. I did take a quick request from our friend here to cut down a couple mangrove trees for sticks. So that way, I don't know what to do with Rupu, but I'm going to take it. So it's a nice request for her. So I'm going to do that and get our favor up and see what happens with good favor. But I'm going to end this here, brothers and sisters. I think we're done great. We'll get back together on a new day in Dinkum next time. So as usual, I hope the rest of your day is not too shabby.